Hello friends, in our last video we have completed uh, the development of our package. So in this video let's see how to deploy this project into SSIS catalog. So before we deploy into SSIS catalog let's uh, change the naming conventions appropriately based on our task. So our task is to generate a state payment summary report right. So let's uh, rename it data flow task like uh, report generate state payment summary okay so let's rename it like this and uh, let's change the package name as well rename state payment summary report okay let's save it now let's try to deploy this into SSIS catalog in our server now go to project and click deploy now next so I want to deploy SSIS in SQL Server. Now say next, server name, localhost in my case, connect, connected. Now browse, it shows you SSIS DB. Create a new folder if you don't have already. Then report, reports, okay, okay creates a new folder and shows here okay so state payment remote report will be deployed this package will be deployed under SSIS DB report section now click next now deploy close now go back to server and verify right click refresh expand expand projects and this is the package 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 and so this is the package we have created just now so let's enable our agent job create a job for this to execute this otherwise you can also execute right click and execute from here so let's let's go back to our target folder and remove these two files here now let's go to source again so we got the source file here and now let's go to server and execute this click OK so go, go to connections and check you can also verify the connections here and you can also check OK and click OK yes So file has been generated, right? So now double click. So file has been generated. So so this is the manual trigger. We it's not executing automatically, right? So let's create a job. Enable it first. For the first time, if we use it for the first time, then we have to enable it. Now expand this and create a new job to automate this file generation process. Now create generate state p 
payment summary report steps new step step 1 generate report type is SSIS SSIS run as agent service catalog server name local host and then package okay now configuration just to verify our connection manager channel if you want to verify you can verify from here source connection and destination connection and click OK so it's done now to click OK expand so the job has been created but uh, I missed it to schedule it let's double click on this again and go to schedules and new enter daily run at 9 a.m. recurring so occurs at daily occurs once at 9 a.m. and start date is today click OK so schedule has been created occurs every day at 9 a.m. okay that's what our requirement is right so you can also set notifications like error email um, and all here click OK so this job now triggers every day at 9 a.m. and generates this report if you want to execute it for manually you can right click and execute so let's go back to target folder and uh, delete this file and again execute the job here okay now go to file and it's generated right so okay so this is how we deploy the package <clears throat> but the project development is not yet completed uh, there are few more steps that we have to um, verify thanks for watching my video please comment if you have any questions